Yo, we've not done one of these in a couple of days, so I think it's that time again, boys. I actually never dueled this guy, Lannister. Let's see if this guy wants to duel. Come on, bro, duel me. Don't be a pussy. Let's go. You ever seen a fanny before? Stop asking my guy Lannister if he's seen a fanny, right? And let's fucking fight. This guy's obviously seen bear puss. He's got 400 item level all around the board. Nearly. Like, this guy's an absolute fucking baller. Take a look at him in all of his glory. Oh my god, we're actually dueling. Where is he? Where's he gone? Where's he gone? Stun him. Oof. Kill him. Kill him with kindness, as Taylor Swift would say. Oh my god, when's he gonna hodge me, boys? When is he gonna do it? Purge that buff off you. Oh my god, when's he gonna hodge me? Oh, there we go. Finally. Nice hodge, bro. GG. Much appreciated. Full fear. I'm gonna trinket this. I'm gonna fade. Fake your kick, maybe. Guess not. Silence you, fake your kick. Faked it. Pull MC, don't one shot me just yet. Just hold on, hold your horses. We're good, boys. Chill, chill, chill. Just gotta stay calm and relax and do what you do best and get kicked in the face by a fucking red paladin. Trinket this, full stun, vampiric embrace, siphon, skadoink. Give me some damage, please. Lord, save me. Oh my god, I got a paladin on me. He's got a bubble. He's gonna hit me like a mole fucking truck. There we go, I just got hit like a truck. Feels bad, man. Mind bender, do damage. Fade, heal, heal, full dots, silence him, mind control. You're mine now, boo boo. You're all mine. Me and you is gonna hug a tree. We're gonna hug that tree real good. Oh my god, mind control. Stay away from me, bro. You're fucking, you're like a savage dog. Full stun, mind blast, siphon, void eruption, death. Oh my god, did he, how did he heal for so much? I feel like he just hacked. Like, who heals for that much ever? I'm healing myself now. Come on, heal. 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 Fade. Dodge Hodge. What's up, boy? Fear him. Full MC him. Off that, because it broke. Full MC. Half MC. Whatever you want to call it. Look, he doesn't even know what just happened. He's like, okay. He literally doesn't even know what happened. That's He's that bad. He's 19. Bro, you're that fucking bad. Mate, this kid's hella salty. He's using my 2v2 rating, which I got playing double DPS, as an excuse not to talk to me. What a fucking bad player, boys. Don't you just hate these fucking plebs. Oh well, next duel. That's one salty pleb. On to the next, boys. I know I do a lot of paladin duels, but I actually like dueling paladins because I feel like it's a pretty fair duel. It's one of the duels that seems 50-50, unless they've got like insane gear and they just literally just one-shot you. All day long. What about a Shadow Priest? Let me buff this guy up. He's got about the same gear as me by the looks of it. We about to duel, bro. We about to throw some fists. Mate, we're throwing fists. Let's go. Me and you, bro. Oh my god, you stunned me way faster than I could stun you. I'm calling hacks, mate. This is this is hacks. What you're doing right now, mate, this is illegal hacks. Fear you. Kill your Siphon. Shield myself. Full dots on this guy. Fade his fade. He faded my silence, but I got distracted. I faded his fear too. I don't know why he even tried it. Purge his powered shield. Give myself one. Use Maledict because he's got Vampiric Embrace up. So I'm going to copy his Vampiric Embrace because you might as well. Trinket this stun. Full dots. I'm going to get silenced in a second. Void Eruption. Do more damage. Come on. Die, please. Silenced me. When I get my stun back, he's going to have to disperse, which is nice. I'm going to try saying Siphon for disperse. Stun. Typhoon him now. Also gonna stun him. I don't know why I stunned him. That was actually a waste. Silence him out. Death, boy. Death. Okay, I guess we're just chilling. You're gonna die. GG. Guy's got better gear than me. Holy fuck, look at that. I want this trinket on my Shadow Priest. Would be so nice. Imagine how much damage I could do. This trinket here is actually fucking hella sick. Like, it's got 370 IM level, but look at what it does. It grants you 838 haste for 8 seconds. And it's just a proc chance. Like, you proc this, you're, like, chilling. How much haste does my Shadow Priest actually have? My Shadow Priest has 1.1k haste. And that trinket grants you 800. And it's on a proc chance. Are we going hard on the rep? Yeah. That's what I like. Doesn't matter really though. I'm gonna stun this healer. Full stun. Chucking healer down. Yeah. I trinket. Silence them. MC. Got it. Maledic. Death. No. I have double fear. Cool. Kill! Yes! The tactics! Mate. Mate, did you see my health? <laughs> oh, mate. I had to click on your name real fast there. Holy fuck. I went full in, mate. We're about to duel a monk. I had a tactic down for beating these guys. But I've not, like, dueled a monk in, like, a few days. So I'm probably going to be hella rusty. 
with my tactic. This guy is called Papa Duke, so I wonder if he's going to be like a kit god or a duke god. I mean, he just kicked nothing, so I mean, I guess that's an easy fake one would say. Trinket this, Maledic, silence him, popping everything, fade his karma, faded his karma. Did I fade his karma? I, can you even fade karma? I don't think you can. I'm actually just going to damage him though, because I think he's dead. He's probably dead, right? Yeah, GG. I'm going to watch that back, because I honestly thought you could fade Kama. I did a lot of damage there. Yo, a few days later. I'd just like to give you guys a quick update on my Azerite traits as a Shadow Priest. At the moment, I'm trying a different set of Azerite traits out. I can't really tell any difference in duels or battlegrounds just yet. I still need to play for it, like, for a little bit. Instead of playing with spiteful apparitions we're playing with whisper of the damned we're stacking whisper of the damned twice we've got two death rows we've got two gem hides and we've also got a chorus of insanity and we've got two heed my calls so this is what my gear looks like this is my helmet this is my shoulders right now and this is my chest piece i just want to talk a little bit about this too on the second row here i'm using retali retaliator however the fuck you pronounce that instead of fort harvester the reason for this i'm just trying it out in jewels it procs a shit ton does this and Fort Harvester, when I come to think about it, whenever you're casting Mind Seer in a duel, you're probably only casting like half of it. When you come to casting Mind Flayers, like when do you ever cast a full Mind Flay in a duel? You normally only cast half or even quarter because you're scared of getting kicked. You want to try fake kick with Mind Flay or something real quick. A lot of people think, oh, that he's casting Mind Flay, so he's just going to cast it full. So they kick you on Mind Flay for some reason and then you fake it. You do like the fastest fucking fake ever with Mind Flay. Feels so good. So instead of playing Fort Harvester, we're playing with this. Just trying it out. See what it's like. With this, you get mastery, so it just increases your overall damage since mastery literally just increases everything you do. We're running 16% haste, which is pretty weird because I used to have 17% the other day. For some reason, it's gone down. I don't really understand why it's gone down. It was 17% haste, and now it's 16. And my item level's gone up by one. I used to have 393 item level, and now it says 394. What the fuck? I've literally not changed any piece of gear. Oh, wait, I'm lying. I'm lying. If I use my safeguard trinket, I get 17% haste. If I use my on-use trinket, which increases my intellect by, like, 2.2k, I get 16% haste. I've been trying this intellect trinket out, too. You do mad amounts of damage when you press it, but... The only problem is you can only use one of these at a time. So if I use my intellect trinket, it puts Maledic on a face second cooldown. If I use Maledic, it puts this on a face second cooldown. So if you're ever going to use a PvP trinket, you just got to remember that. It's probably better using a PvP trinket and then a on-use trinket like this in my bags. Probably doing a setup like this. So you've got a chance of increasing your intellect by 737. But I mean, it's just the proc. But if you're going to play like this... I'd recommend waiting for your Sinister Gladiator's badge, uh, insignia, whatever the fuck it's called, to proc, and then pop your Gladiator's badge for, like, the mad amount of intellect. Anyway, let's do some jewels. Gonna equip my Safeguard Trinket, and I'm going to equip Maledic. Alright, let's get into some more jewels. I'm gonna duel a Shadow Priest. I can't remember what I've jeweled in this video so far. I think I might have jeweled a Priest. Probably jeweled a Red Paladin. I might have jeweled a Mage. And I think I showed a 2v2 clip. Okay, this guy Trinketed my stun, so I'm just gonna silence him. I'm gonna purge his buff off. I'm gonna purge his other one. I'm gonna fear him here. Full fear. I'm gonna MC him off this, because it's gonna break. He silenced me. I'm gonna Siphon on him. I probably could have done that opener a lot better. Trinket this. Probably just going to fade here to try dodge silence, and I didn't dodge it. We got mad damage here. We're in void form. I feel like he's doing more damage than me, though. Like, a lot more damage. He's coming in for the uh, fear. So I'm just going to mind bender and run away. He's healing, so I'm just going to copy when he heals to try and stay at the same level. going to run back towards him since he's a little bit scared right now, but I have my stun back, so he's pretty fucked. Void eruption back, too. There's his disperse. Going to siphon. Going to reapply my buffs since all he's done is purge, and he's forfeited the duel. GG, boys. And now he's running away. Feels bad, man. I want to duel this frost mage. I've not really dueled a decent frost mage in a while. This guy seems pretty decent. He's got good gear. He's got pretty decent rating. He's gem stacked to fuck. This guy's been so lucky. Look how many gem slots he's got. He's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Holy fuck. This guy's gear is looking like mock. Fully gemmed up. Alright, with Julian a Frost Mage, I don't know if he wants to go stealth. He probably does. Okay, he's not gone stealth just yet, so that's a little bit weird. I thought he was going to get stealth, so I didn't stun him instantly. Going to stun him now. And effect. Ah, oh, he got it pretty quick there. I was actually going to fake cast that. Oh, well. We're just going to fade and heal while he's got his cooldowns up. Just try waste his cooldowns, and now we're going to try purge it. And try purge his cooldowns. Got his cooldowns off. Popping as much damage as we can here while we've got Void Eruption up. Just going to shield myself. Going to cast a few more heals while he doesn't have his kickback. Going to purge his shield ASAP. Going to heal here. 
He's got his kickback now. Do damage, purge that shield. He's maledicking on me. I'm going to maledick on him. He's actually rare frosting on me right now. That's actually a really good combo. Well played. We're going to pop some Vampiric Embrace. Fake his kick, maybe. Fake his kick with Mind Flare. Mind Blast into Vampiric Touch. Gonna shield myself. Got my safeguard trinket up too. Gonna stun him. Mind blast into him because he doesn't have kick. Gonna heal myself now because he's ice blocked. Purge him. Try purge that shield so my mind bender does raw damage. Siphon on him. Can't get close to him to silence. Got close enough to silence. He doesn't have his trinket back because he wasted it in the opener. And now we're just gonna death him. GG. Like to point out, still got this burst, so we're pretty fucking Gucci. Not a bad duel. I definitely could have played it better. But not a bad duel. Me and this red paladin's about to go. Never dueled this guy before either, which is nice. I like dueling people that I've never dueled before. What's this fucking shield you've got? Are you a prop? Are you prop, bro? Please tell me if you're prop, because that wouldn't be nice. I'm gonna fade here to dodge Hodge. Is he gonna do it? He didn't do it, boys. I think I'm max ranging him right now with that. I'm gonna purge his freedom so that he walks slow because of um Siphine. If I get hodged out here, I'm gonna have to run back. Trinket, run back. Maledic. Vampiric Embrace. Do damage, fake kick maybe. Try fake kick now. Come on, kick me, bro. You know you wanna. Full stun, faked his kick. He trinketed, so I'm gonna disperse. Just gonna get some distance on him. 360, Vampiric Embrace. What's this fucking shield proc he's got? Just gonna cast in his face now and kill him. He's gonna have to bubble here, I think. Come on, bubble, you bitch. Bubble, 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 wobble, wobble. What's this shield proc he's getting? I see like this thing popping up all the time on his buff and I've never seen it before. He was a pretty bad paladin to be honest. The thing that I've started doing and I need to stop doing is popping Vampiric Embrace when I don't really have any cooldowns available like Void Eruption. Popping Vampiric Embrace when you don't really have Void Eruption and the enemy still has a kick. It's like... It feels like a waste of a cooldown because you can't get too much damage out there. And when you pop Vampiric Embrace, you want to do as much damage as you can so you can get as much healing as you can out of Vampiric Embrace. So why, basically what I did in that duel was I popped Vampiric Embrace after I used Void Eruption, which that meant then that I couldn't Void Eruption in Vampiric Embrace. It was hard to generate insanity because I'd just come out of Void Eruption. He had kick, so I had to try fake kick, but he was also doing burst damage at the same time. So I couldn't really just stand there and flop my dick about and do damage to him because I had to fake kick and I had to stay stay alive at the same time. So what I think I need to start doing is if I burst on someone at the start without having to use Vampiric Embrace, because most duels, like you both got ham at the start, right? And then you pop Vampiric Embrace and then you get your full use out of Vampiric Embrace because you've got Void Eruption and you're living through their burst. But if you get the opener on them and they're not really doing much in the start and you actually pop Void Eruption before using Vampiric Embrace and you just get a full Void Eruption off on them and you've not had to pop Vampiric Embrace, and then they go ham on you, maybe it's probably better to disperse if they have kick available instead of just taking tons of damage and putting yourself in such a bad situation because then later on you're gonna have Vampiric Embrace because basically what I did there was waste two cooldowns. I mean, I Vampiric Embraced, didn't really get much out of it and then when it came round to it, I'm just having to disperse like a little bit later. But if I'd have just dispersed in the start anyways, I'd have probably been a lot more comfortable in that duel and I'd have got more out of my Vampiric Embrace. All right, there's no duels outside Ogre at the moment, so I thought I'd end this video with a 2v2 skirmish. It's double Shadow Priest. I mean, would you fucking look at that? There's two Shadow Priests up in this thing. All right, we got this, boys. We got this. Got the dots on this warrior. Can't get sapped. My Shadow Priest is hitting me, so I mean, he should be Gucci too. Fuck. Oh my God, he got the sap on me. Wow. Just as I said can't get sapped gg well played it's a good job i picked fucking life swap for this guy i mean he's fucking dead mate blind me full wow gg bro you're such a fucking professional at this game please teach me one day nice and sap bro oh my god look at these waz players holy fuck teach me senpai oh my god sapped me again oh my god who is this guy bro if you just come in my line we're so gucci we are so gucci we are fucking gucci bro we got this in the bag boys we have got this in the fucking bag, lade. Don't worry, bro. You're fucking fine. Just chill on your HP, okay? Chill. You're Gucci, bro. You're Gucci. Look how Gucci we are, boys. We're so fucking Gucci. Look how I'm swap on me instantly. Fake this guy's kick instantly. Heal myself the full real quick. Chuck this guy some big fucking deaths. Dispersion. Easy peasy. Lemon the fucking squeezy. Bro, what was that fucking grip? Bro, my grip literally fucking saved your life. And that grip you just did to me was like a two-step. Anyway, guys, hit that like button if you enjoyed this video today. Comment down below, subscribe to the channel. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. <laughs>